Kingdom MMA here with Graham Turner at Cage Warriors 69. Excellent performance out there, Graham. Talk us through the fight. You know, um, kind of wanted to you know, go out there and uh, you know, work in my wrestling. Yeah, it was a perfect fight for it. I knew that. You know, um, so I forgot it. it was a really good, you know, kind of good striker, good flicky like, kicks. Uh, so, you know, I wanted to you know, get him up against the cage, uh, put the grind on him, get some grounding found, you know, and, uh, you know, as I say, just kind of grind him down for the finish. And the uh, third round came out, I knew that he was really, you know, his tank was empty. I opened him up for the body shot uh, through it, and he just, you know, he folded. Got him, you know, couldn't have got him anymore, you know, sweeter than what I did. And throughout the fight, there was just relentless takedown over and over and over. I mean, were you surprised how easy it was to take the fight to the ground? Did, <coughs> did you prepare for that, or, or did it, it kind of come by surprise that you could take take him down so easily and kind of grind him out there? No, I see, I've been working a lot in my wrestling uh, recently. I, I kind of don't use it often enough as what I should. And that's what I said, it was a perfect fight to kind of, you know, go and start showing that I can, you know, wrestle as well as strike. And um, I just, you know, got him against the cage and just kept working, you know, getting good tight positions, working my head position, getting my double unders and taking him down. And uh, also working from the, the single leg, you know, breaking his foot from underneath him. Try to get a uh, heavy head position on him and hip position and, you know, work uh, ground and pound against the cage. And you caught him there in the third round with an excellent body shot. When, when that connected, did you know that was it? Could you, could you sense that, you know, he's in real trouble there? Obviously, he went down, but, you know, experienced fighter like yourself, did you did you know that that was going to be the finish then? Yeah, I kind of, I seen him, he was, he was looking for the right uppercut as I was throwing, you know, my, my leg kicks. So, I kind of stepped to my left to make him step to his left, and he was leaving himself wide open at the body, and I've been working a lot of my body shots, like, and as well as when I'm working in my boxing. And uh, as soon as I hit him, I, I just knew, just like, it was like an instinct, I knew he was going down, and then I just dived in the ball him to get the finish. Now, the time out before this, you got caught by Jim Allers for the featherweight title. Obviously, he's moved over to the UFC now. Are you looking to get back into the picture for that title? You know, I, I'd, I'd love to, you know, get my, my hands on that title, you know. It's one of the belts that I really, really do want to get my hands on. But, you know, I, I just kind of, whatever fight comes in front of me, whatever intensity, you know, fight management and... My coach James, you know, whatever they decide to put in front of me, I take, you know. But I really do want to work my way back up the ladders, get some, you know, wins under my belt. And if the opportunity comes to go for the title, you know, I'll, I'll dive at the opportunity. And then finally, Graham, Stevie Ray's fighting in the main event here at Cage Warriors. Fought Kurt Warburton previously. What does he do this time differently to win this fight, to take home the belt, you know, become the title holder again? I think the first fight around, uh, Stevie gave Kurt too much respect from, you know, with Kurt being in the UFC. Uh, this time around, uh, you know, Stevie's, he's, no, he's, he's not going to give him that kind of amount of respect. He's just going to, you know, go for the finish. You know, uh, Stevie's had uh, been training for 12 weeks for this fight. He's hungry, you know, after his last performance when he wasn't well. He, you know, I could see it through him, you know, really annoyed. And to get this opportunity, this title again, you know, he's hungry. Yeah, I think he's, you know, he's going to get into the business tonight. Graham, congratulations on an excellent performance again, mate. Thanks. All the best, pal. Yeah, All right.